Welcome Aries to Amore e Bella Tarot. Thank you so very much for letting me enter into your space. I am so very, 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 very blessed. Um, this is a love spread for you guys on this uh, 7th of November. Unbelievable. Thank you, Father Almighty. Amen. We're going to receive uh, two messages per station. And then we're going to receive a few other messages from, um, from some other decks. All right. We're going to get a fairy. A fairy message. A fairy message. Very good. Let's see what the fairies have to tell our beautiful Aries. Okay, and now we begin your beautiful love spread with these beautiful cards. I love all my cards. I'm so lucky I've come across so many. <laughs> Hopefully I keep uh, being successful on the YouTube channel. That way I can continue to purchase some more. And your uh, message from these beautiful cards is manifestation. Manifestation. Believe in, your, in yourself. Trust your instincts and follow your heart. For in doing so, you shall manifest all your heart desires. The life you have for so long aspired to create will soon manifest. So, so whatever it is that you're wishing upon, it is going to come forth soon. So, so know that uh, soon you will have all those, all those blessings. But you have to open your heart, Aries. And here, lost and found, what was once lost is about to be found. Thanks, thanks to the lost and found fairy. Sometimes she can help us find things we never even realized were lost. Amen. Amen. And maybe sometimes it was not the right timing. Uh, the two of you had to grow and learn and embrace and come together at the proper timing, in divine timing. And here we have the six and somebody from the past. There is somebody from, I know, I know. But you know what? There's room for growth. There's room for, you know, reminiscing. Somebody's reminiscing about the past. And you're guarding your heart. You're not going to accept just whomever or whatever. You're not going to just jump on the first opportunity that knocks on your door. Here, you're making a decision. You are you know that there's something grand, something waiting for you out there, and you're, you're going to make a decision. And you're starting something very passionate with the Ace of uh, Wands. You're starting something very passionately that is going to bring you a lot of satisfaction, that is going to bring you a lot of success. But you have to make the decision to move forward, Aries. And here you're working very hard on your coins. You're working very hard on your future. You're focusing on your job or maybe starting a new business. But you're working hard on love. It's like you're opening up your heart to the lovers. This, this, this union that is going to stimulate you in all of the elements. This union that is going to... to um, this union that is going to help you... Um, just just love yourself and grow and, and be a better version of yourself. Uh, a union that is spiritually guided to you. So this person is going to stimulate you in all of the elements, spiritually, emotionally, mentally. So a union that is, that is definitely um, divinely guided towards you. All right, my Aries, we're going to receive a message from these beautiful cards to see what our angels want to let you know. Okay. And your message is, look at how beautiful those cards are. Your message is criticizing one another will only lead to further unhappiness. Love and accept each other as you are. And your relationship will magically transform. Amen. So let's be kind to one another. Um, nobody is perfect. True, true that. True that. True that. There is no perfection. So we just have to grow and expand and, and embrace. And if it's not good for you, if it's not making you be a better person, then you must move on to somewhere else where they will, uh, where you will grow and love and be at peace with your life. All right, let's see what else we got going on for our Aries, Aries Nation. Yeah, yeah. 
see what we have see what we have I want to send a shout out to Lori what's up Lori love you miss you I know you're moving my way moving moving is not the funnest but it's it is very um, change is good change is grand all right here we go here we go and your message here with these lovers and you're, you're opening up your heart you have the um, the emperor and <laughs> that is magical I cannot believe this the power couple how about that where the lovers is so somebody who is here to to love you to value you to embrace you to to lift you to somebody who is ready to do some shenanigans with you somebody who is vibing just as high as you are with the lovers divinely guided amen i hope this happens to all of our aries all over the earth and here we have you have decision to make and it's the two twos are here so you have a decision to make let's let's take our blindfold and let's ask our heart the heart is where the answer is so follow your heart there you will uh, do some meditating go do some walks in mother nature go water is definitely a very good meditation a very good um, uh, it helps you hear your heart so water a body of water is important for you to to get the proper answer of your dreams your goals and your and your life and here you have somebody who wants to um, get those uh, cupid's arrows and, and let you know how much they love you what they want to do to you how much and how long they've been in love with you with the ace of cups that have the biggest cup of love so there's definitely true love with somebody new somebody wants to come uh, and maybe um, somebody who just has been totally different that you don't expect but they want to come offer you this cup of love that is long term and, and, and they want to communicate with you very badly and then here we have you are sitting in your throne you are making intelligent decisions and you're also embracing um, celebrating loving life um, and putting yourself in places that um, that of interest of you and and there you will find that partnership that thinks and wants the same things out of life so you're definitely making your 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 moves very strategically you're very intelligently making all your decisions and yes ma'am you're working hard you're working hard trying to see clearly trying to make the best decisions of your life so you're you're taking charge of your life and you're and you're writing your story you're you're writing your book and you're writing you're taking responsibility for your life you're making the right choices intelligent uh, very very um, strategic moves and and you're going towards your love to the power couple guys look with the lovers up there the emperor and the empress the uh, two cards came together in the place, same placement out of 78 cards. It's unbelievable. The power couple. All right, let's do a little bit more cl clarification for a beautiful. Oh, I can't believe it. That is beautiful. I love it. I love it. Let's do one more. Let's see what we have for our Aries. Our Aries in this beautiful 7th of November. That felt pretty good. Let's see what our angels have to let us know. We're going to receive two, two messages per placement. To see what our angels have for us. Okay. Now we're going to pick one more. I'm so happy. I really do enjoy uh, doing this for you guys. I, I would like to have more interaction with uh, my community. Um, so I'm going to start trying to do some different things. I'm kind of just thinking about maybe doing some free spreads for the, for the, for the video most viewed. But we'll see. I'm, I'm, I'm working on that. And here we have a six of cups and you have to make a decision. So there's some decision that you must make. Um, somebody who you have grand memories. Somebody who you feel is very loyal. So you have to make a decision. You're at a Y. 
And here you want to go to calm waters. You want to go to tram a tranquil place. Somebody's helping you see that that is the, li the way life should be. You need to be at peace. You need to be in a place where you're loved, nurtured, appreciated, uh, and, and, and treated like a, like an empress, like an emperor. Oh, God, I'm just saying. Shoot. And here we go with the Ace of Wands, with the Ace of Cups, uh, and the star, my lantern. The Ace of Wands is right there, too. So there's definitely a lot of, somebody is definitely um, stimulating your passionate feelings here, um, Aries, and it's something that you've been manifesting, it's something that you've been asking the heavens for. So there's a new love coming your way that is offering you um, happiness, uh, a healthy relationship, go to, to a tranquil place with a lot of love, somebody who is vibing just as high as you are. And here we have the Three of Cups with the Queen of uh, Wands. It's like somebody in, in injected a bunch of happiness, a lot of energy, a lot of self-love, self-love. You know your worth, you know what you want out of this life, and you're not going to settle for anything. You're, you're, so look at this, look at this, the three of cups came out twice in the same placement. So you're definitely going to places of interest of you, and you're exposing yourself to different individuals. You're, um opening up your heart to receive the greatest gift of all. So you're ready, you're open, you're uh, ready to embrace um, what you deserve, what you deserve. Because you, you're just, you're just vibing high, you're loving yourself, you know you deserve high. <laughs> the Ten of the Pentacles, Aries. That is, the to me, the best card on the deck. So you're loving yourself, you have this, you, you found somebody who wants to do the same things, who has the same visions of life and how to live it to the max. A lot of loyalty, um, grandkids, uh, children, healthy, uh, a lot of abundance, a lot of coins. So you're definitely, somebody's leaving their, somebody is leaving their, their happy single life to be a part of a, a, a divinely guided union. Amen. I hope it resides with all my beautiful Aries. All right, now we're going to give a little bit more clarification to this love spread. Let's see what we have. Let's see what our angels want to tell us. Let's see. Okay. And your message is, dun, 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 your message is abandonment. Uh, fear, abandonment issues are affecting your relationship. Ghosting, uh, forgive yourself especially. Let's love ourselves. We need to know that we deserve all the greatness of this life. And only you can stop yourself from achieving it. And here, altered, altered of you. Seeing things differently than they are. Past con conditioning influencing situation. Re-evaluate. So you're kind of analyzing the, the situation in multiple um, angles. You're uh, looking at the situation in, in different perspectives before you make a decision. Trust issues, Santa Maria. A certain if trust issues are justified or, or a or unjustified. Trust is imperative to feeling safe and secure. So somebody is uh, obviously has trust trust issues, and that's that's when we need to uh, evolve. We need to meditate. We need to love ourselves. We need to love ourselves first before we're able to open our heart to anybody else. <laughs> and your baggage, not letting go, hanging on to the past hurts, issues. Identify and heal patterns that impact relationship, relationships. So definitely we have to love ourselves. And by forgiving uh, our past, uh, the, the people that hurt us in the past, uh, really helps us love ourselves because you are who you are today. Thanks for all those transformations, all those situations that made you become the great human being that you are today. And if you don't see it like that, that's why you need to forgive your past uh, hurt, people that hurt you, 
They were the ones that helped you uh, transform to the great person that you are today. So we need to embrace, we need to forgive, and we need to love ourselves. That's the main thing. And here your message is money issues, fighting over money, heal root chakra, lack of trust, fear in safety, security, survival control. So somebody wants to control. Uh, money is a big, big, big uh, relationship destroyer. That's what I call it. Actually, it destroys everything. But money is here. Let's use money. Let's think of money as a tool to better the earth not a necessity to to i don't know why people want to have so much money in the bank money is to flow so um definitely um money is just an item that is here to help us uh, live comfortably i guess all right let's see what else we have for y'all with one of these cards let's see what our angels want to tell us on this love spread all right let me know what part of the earth you're receiving this message. I know I say it all the time and I multiple say it, but I really, really want more communication. I want to get to know you guys. Stabbed in the back, Santa Maria. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. So somebody else, you're, you're in a happy place. Somebody is unhappy. Maybe whoever didn't treat you good in the past is now uh, feeling like you, uh, you don't want them anymore. And why? You got the emperor and the empresses over here with, with the lovers. You are good. You're sitting fat, Aries. You don't need to worry about anybody else. Um, bless them. Wish them well. Mm -hmm. We are going to finalize this beautiful spread with two messages. Let's we'll see what, what we have for you guys here. For our Aries and Nation. Okay, let's take these two. And your message on this beautiful November 7th is ta -ta -ta -ta, warning, don't dismiss the red flags here. There's somebody who's very angry. There's somebody who's very angry and who feels like you betrayed them because you're so happy, Aries. So be careful. Just make take take the you know, don't don't ignore the red flags. Don't ignore the red flags. And here your message is um, from the person in mind. What is your person in mind wants to tell you, Aries, is if I knew then what I know now, I would have made different choices. Amen. But they, they screwed up and you no longer want to be a part of them because you found somebody who is vibing just as high as you are. Why would you go back to, to people that feel like this? Yeah, no, no, no. Let it go. You know what's best for you. You know what is right for you, and you, you will make the best decision. Thank you so much. God bless. Blessings. Love. Peace.